Welcome back to the channel. Good to see you. Uh, today we got a fella. Let me see. What is his name? His name is Robert West. And he's going to get trespassed from a uh, public building for tra for uh, filming transactions. I'm not sure what kind of a building it is because he doesn't say. But yeah, he's going to get trespassed. And uh, he's going to do the usual uh, sovereign citizen First Amendment auditor script with the state troopers. And they don't care. Anyway, let's check it out. It's very short. It's kind of funny to me that he didn't show the incident that happened. Right now he's being trespassed from the building. He's not showing what happened before that. So there's no way to, of verifying anything he says is true. How convenient. Okay, so I don't know if you could hear all that, but um, hmm. so a couple of uh, consequences of the choice you made today. So the first one is that you are going to be trespassed from the building and hopefully remove on you know your own cooperation. Mm -hmm. uh, the trespass for today is again for 24 hours for recording business transactions or Taking an attempt, making an attempt to try to record the business area where that's not allowed. Mm -hmm. uh, if you want to finish transacting your official business before you leave today, we'll permit you to do that before you're asked to remove yourself from the building. But in mm -hmm. order to do that, you need to disable the camera up before you go back into the. You can't violate my First Amendment rights. I got rights. My rights. The business area of the building before you leave this area and go over there where customers could have an expectation of being able to transact financial business without you making copies of their, their private information. Okay, there's no one back there, so why can't I just go back there like because this? Because in that area where that type of business is transacted and where the cashiers are and where their computers are and where private information is likely to be or be displayed out in the office or on the desk, recording is not allowed in that area. And one other thing, the word no is a complete sentence. End of story. You can't record it from this side of the tape. You can't record it from that side of the tape. That area is not to be recorded. So if you want to transact your business, we can turn the camera off or leave it out here with us, and then we can go in there and transact your business, and then you're going to leave the building uh, and uh, experience a 24-hour trespass, and then next time you come and visit, if we can comply with that expectation to not record in that area, uh, then I don't anticipate that we'll have issues like this in the future. Well, I'm sure we will. I mean, I'm going to file another tort claim. You know that as well as I do. <laughs> How did I know he was going to threaten another lawsuit? This cop doesn't give a crap. He really doesn't. I can't <laughs> take my like day-to-day -day, uh, actions and I like, know. transact police business mm -hmm. based on whether or not you're going to file a tort claim. Like, right. To me, that is that's a complete non-issue. It's not for me to consider right. on the side of the road. But my job is to conduct business in a way mm -hmm. that's lawful mm -hmm. and to carry out the uh, public interest uh, in you know, the state's business and being able to protect the customers that come here to mm -hmm. transact their business and be able to assist the building manager in well, executing the removal order that they're uh, putting together. But uh, whether or not you're making a tort claim is really of no consequence to me. Okay. Uh, what I'll do is I'll turn my camera off. Okay. But I'm going to do it under duress because I don't want to do it. Under duress means absolutely nothing in this situation, fool. Because there's no way for me to prove that I turned anything in. Sure. Okay. Get a receipt. They always give you a receipt for whatever you turn in. Unless, um, unless I video record it. Um, number two, there's two troopers and a sergeant that are here. Um, I, I, I respect your rank, so that's why I said sergeant instead of trooper. Okay. Um, I appreciate that. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn it off. I'm going to go in turn this in sure. and then once I turn this in then once I leave that restricted area I'm going to turn the camera back on 
and I'll leave the building. I have no problem with that. And if you want to turn that back on before we continue to talk, that's totally fine. Uh, and as far as the business processes go, I'm not involved in their business process, but I strongly suspect if you were to ask the cashier for some type of receipt that you turned a document in, they'd probably provide you something. I'm going to ask them that they file it and make me a copy of it. Sure. That, if so. you're, you're, I have no reason that you're not allowed to do that. Okay. Okay. Yep. And... And another guy who likes to cut his video off right at the end there before any, you know, anything finishes. That was a body cam from the state, from somebody. And, uh, yeah, weird. Weird how the, that ended like that. I wonder what happened after that. Of course, he won't upload it. It show just like he didn't show what happened in the first place. Anyway, he's trespassed for 24 hours. No big deal. Who knows what he was trying to do. They said he was getting a... Uh, uh, video of transactions taking place so you know we know how that goes we know how that works out anyway hope you enjoyed the short video love y'all bye